Right, so here we are again, day eight uh, on this field. It's uh, quite a nice morning at the moment, although there's uh, a bit of a uh, north wind blowing through, so it's a bit nippy. But uh, it's forecast to rain heavily by this afternoon. So I'm going to try and get as much done as I can. And uh, if I can't get it finished, we'll come back another day. Right, let's get moving then and see if we can find anything today. Right, uh, another good signal here. Um, this one gave it us about five centimeters, which is about right. It's uh, definitely not small sod there. So let's see. Right. Hmm. Strange little thing. Uh, maybe a part of. Um, oh, it looks like a, a keyhole cover. Possibly. Okay. All right. Keyhole cover. Um, probably. All right, we'll clean it up and come back and let you know. Okay, first find of the day. Right, so a few steps further on and another signal. Again, very shallow. And right in the corner of the hole there. It is. Oh, another one. Yeah. Uh, another lock cover. Okay. Two lock covers, both different. Right. Carry on then. Another one here. Um, again, very shallow. Uh, took this bit out from beneath the sod. Oh, there it is. Okay, if you can see that, just the rim of something there. Um, right, pewter button this time. Oh, very nice pattern on it though. Okay, I don't know if you can see that on the camera, but there's this really nice pattern on that one. Okay, nice find. Let's carry on then and see what else we can get. We have a, a bit of pottery in the hole, glazed pottery. Um, no idea how old it is, but I'm not sure time team could tell me, but there you go. Okay. nice buttons and let's see if we can find some content today. Let's move on. Okay, here we are then, uh, day nine. Um, nice looking day today. Rain's finally went away. It's uh, forecast to be nice and sunny today. A uh, little bit of a cool breeze, but we can live with that. So let's crack on and see what we can find then. 
Alright, uh, first good signal for the day. Um, <coughs> gave it us about 10 centimetres. So I dug the sod out here. And uh, I then took this clump out from the bottom of the hole. And uh, the find is right there. Um, I can see it. Yep. And it's a coin. It's an old penny. Um, I believe it's possibly Victorian. Uh, yeah, I think that's a Victorian penny. Okay, first find of the day is a coin. Um, quite nice. Let's move on and see if we can get any more like this. Get back to you. Okay, another good signal here. Uh, gave it us five centimeters and uh, still in the hole apparently. Okay, that's a corner there. And we got here then. Um, cease, I don't know. I'm not sure of this. It's, I thought it had some writing on there. But, uh, maybe not. Ah. Okay. Not sure on this one. It's uh, it's shaped copper, certainly. Okay, we'll clean it up and see see what it is. Come back to on this one. Let's go see what else we can find. All right, it's another good one here. Um, it's out there and it's in the sod. at the surface look on this bit. And it is, it's come out. And it's uh okay. Little lead ball. It's got a base on it. That's okay, strange one. Right, we'll clean that up and come back to you. Let's go see what else it is. Right, so another one here, a very shallow, gave it as five centimetres. It's definitely out there. There it is. Oh, okay. Very nice. It's another another tom back button with a very nice, very nice pattern on it. Um, yeah, this is uh, this is 18th century. Very nice find for the day. Okay, let's move on. See what else we can find. And again, it's not very deep, and it is out again in the sod. Hmm. Okay. 
more button I believe. I think. Not sure. Okay, we'll check it out and come back to you. Let's move on. Well, alright, uh, listen, I've come right back to you on that button that I thought it was. And hey, I think I've got my very first hammered coin. And I believe it's Roman. I really think so. I can see the outline of a head on that. I think it's, I'm pretty sure it's uh, copper or bronze or whatever. Don't think it's silver. Uh, but I'm sure I can see the outline of a head on that side. And uh, I can certainly see something on the other side. But that is definitely 100% my very first ever complete in one piece hammered coin. And I'm chuffed to bloody bits about it. All right, I'll try and get this cleaned up a bit. See if I can get it id and come back to you. All right, the whole day has been worth it just for that. Great. Let's move on. All right, another one here, and it's taken a, a lot of digging to find it. But uh, right here in this slice. Again, I'm not too sure on this one. I'm not even going to make guesses anymore. Um, I think it's maybe a button, but again, we'll check it out and come back to you. Okay, let's move on. All right, uh, another good signal here. Um, came off with very shallow, it's about five centimeters, but. I missed it, so I sliced this, the hole again. I don't know, I think this may even be on the surface. It's, if it is, it's, I'd say it's probably rubbish. But, who knows? Nope, still there. Okay. Oh, it's not rubbish. It's another coin. Oh, just shows to go, doesn't it? And it's a penny. Um, not sure whose. It looks like a. Looks like possibly an Edward the Seventh or a George the Fifth. Okay, another coin though. Um, yeah, you just can never tell, can you? All right, let's move on. All right, uh, very close now to finishing for the night. Um, got one good signal here. Very shallow. Give it us five centimetres. And uh, not even sure if it's that. So, okay, let's have a look. All right. Actually, see it there. And again, not a lot of idea. Um, first glance, I'd have probably said it was a wing nut, but I don't think it's that. It's hollow. Ah, interesting. Some sort of looks possibly like a ring. Wow. You can see that, uh, yeah, possibly, maybe a stone should have been in the middle, but yeah, it definitely looks like a ring. Okay, we'll see what we can do with it, and um, maybe not, maybe a handle, <laughs> okay, whatever, right, we'll clean it up and see what we can do with it, and uh, try and get it ID'd, come back to you. Okay, let's move on. 